The captains tonight for the Indians, number five, Jared Lofton, and number eight, David Pat. Captains for the Oilers, number seven, starting Gallander, number eight, Ray Prejay. Number 45, Morgan Smith, and number 72, Logan Wells. The Indians won the coin toss and have elected to receive the opening kickoff. Taking the kickoff for the Indians, brought down by Landon Fredrickson. The Indians will start out first down and 10 at their own 44 yard line. by the Indians, goes incomplete, brings up second down and 10 yards to go.
Thomas, the ball carrier for the Indians. Knock away by Morgan Smith and Landon Vickerstead. Indians have third down and four yards to go. Again, the ball here for the Indians. Brought down by Hayden Smith. Play was enough for a first down. The Indians have a first down and 10 at the order of 43-yard line. Hit by the Indians goes incomplete. Comes up second down and 10 yards to go. Tanner Stubing on the quarterback keeper for the Indians, brought down by Landon Fredrickson. Throws it up for a first down. The Indians have a first down and 10 at the order, 25 yard line. Thomas goes in for an Indians touchdown. The extra point attempt by the Indians is no good. Aiden Smith taking the kickoff for the Oilers, brought down by Austin Williams. We have a penalty flag on the field.
up his dead ball personal foul against the Indians. After the penalty, the Oilers will start out with the first down and 10 at the end of the 46-yard line. Logan Houghton carrying the ball for the Oilers, brought down by Logan Townsend. Loss on the play, brings up second down, 12 yards to go for the Oilers. J. Ball here for the Oilers. Start down by Tanner Scooby. Oilers have third down and seven yards to go. Play was recovered by the Oilers, Marcus Hashaw. Loss on the play brings up fourth down and 12 yards to go for the Oilers. After the 43-yard punt by Cole Wyatt, the Indians will start out with a first down and 10 at their own three-yard line. Ball here for the Indians. Tackle made by Jocelyn Bickerstaff. Run is enough for first down. The Indians have a first down and 10 at their own 14 yard line. Darius McQueen, the ball carrier for the Indians. Tackle made by Logan Houghton. Players left for first down. Indians have a first down and 10 throw. 25 yard line. Completed to Byron Thomas, brought down by Hayden Smith. In a six yards on the play, the Indians have second down and four yards to go.
Darius McQueen, the ball carrier for the Indians. Brought down by Sterling Gallander. Runs enough for a first down. The Indians have a first down and 10 at the order 46 yard line. Hit by the Indians goes incomplete. We have a penalty on the play. It's holding against the Indians. to go. Stooping on the quarterback keeper for the Indians. Brought down by Colton Bracken. Indians have third down and seven yards to go. goes in for a Indians touchdown. Point kick by Jackson Cathy is good.
Peyton Smith making the kickoff for the Oilers, brought down by Tristan Lawrence. five-yard penalty against the Indians for offsides, so the Oilers will start out with a first down and 10 from their own 38-yard line. Great <laughs> Frije carrying the ball for the Oilers. Brought down by Armando Batista. In eight yards on the play, brings up second down and two yards to go for the order. Again, the ball here for the other. Brought down by Satan Chandler. Brought it up for a first down. The Orders have a first down and 10 at the Indian 44 yard line. for the Oilers, knocked out of bounds by Dayton Chandler. Gain of nine yards on the play, brings up second down and one yard to go for the Oilers. We have a timeout on the field. Replay the ball carrier for the Oilers, brought down by Wyatt Sneed. Oilers have a third down and about a half yard to go for a first down. Fredrickson carrying the ball for the Oilers. Stopped by Tanner Stubing. 
No gain on the play. Brings up fourth down and about a half yard to go for the Oilers. on the play was recovered by the Indians, Tristan Ard. Indians will start out with a first down and 10 from their own 49-yard line. Wyatt Sneed, the ball carrier for the Indians. Tackle made by Jocelyn Bickerstaff. <laughs> Rums enough for a first down. The Indians will have a first down and 10 at the order of 21 yard line. attempt by the Indians was broken up by Hayden Smith. The Indians have second down and 10 yards to go. Touchdown. Point kick by Jackson Cathy is good.
Aiden Smith taking the kickoff for the orders. Tackle made by Tristan Ard. Orders will start out with a first down and 10 from their own 37 yard line. Ray Frije carrying the ball for the Oilers. Stopped by Carter Cox. Loss on the play brings up second down to a guard's go for the Oilers.
Sterling Gallon with a whiz ball carry for the Oilers. Brought down by Gunnar Wilson. That's the end of our first quarter with the score Indians 20 Oilers 0. After the punt, the Indians will start with a first down and 10 at their own 37-yard line.
pass attempt by the Indians goes incomplete. Brings up second down and 10 yards to go. And Kathy, the ball carrier for the Indians, tackle made by Jocelyn Vickerstad. James enough for a first down. The Indians have a first down and 10 at their own 48 yard line. Completed to Jacob Alexander, brought down by Logan Houghton. The room play was enough for first down. The Indians have a first down and 10 at the Oiler 41 yard line. Shooting on the quarterback keeper for the Indians, brought down by Landon Fredrickson. That was enough for a first down. The Indians have a first down goal to goal at the order 10 yard line. goes in for an Indians touchdown. Kick by Jackson Kathy is good.
Aiden Smith taking the kickoff for the Oilers, brought down by St. Rees. Landon Frederick's been carrying the ball for the Oilers, brought down by Logan Townsend. Gain of one on the play, brings up second down nine yards to go for the Oilers. Carrying the ball for the Oilers, brought down by Armando Batista. Penalty on play was offside against the Indians. That penalty is declined. We'll have a first down and 10 at the Indian 41 yard line. Carrying the ball for the Oilers, tackle made by Gunnar Wilson. And six yards on the play, brings up second down, four yards to go for the Oilers. Sportlike conduct against the Oilers. J carrying the ball for the Oilers. Tackle made by Tristan Ard. For us have fourth down and 13 yards to go. After the punt, the Indians will start out with the first down and 10 from their own 26 yard line. Thank you. 
Pass is completed to Billy Thomas. Pass completed to Darius McQueen. Tackle made by Hayden Smith. That was enough for a first down. The Indians have a first down and 10 at their own 39 yard line. by the Indians is broken up by Logan Houghton. And just took a down 10 yards to go for the Indians. for the Indians, brought down by Logan Wells. Indians have third down and six yards to go. Thomas goes in for an Indians touchdown. Kick by Jackson Kathy is good. I'm 
We appreciate the ball carry for the Oilers, brought down by Wyatt Sneed. No gain on the play, brings up second down and 10 yards to go for the Oilers. Marcus Hatchell, the quarterback keeper for the Oilers. Brought down by Logan Townsend. No gain on the play, brings up third down and 10 yards to go for the Oilers. Attempt by the Oilers goes incomplete. Brings up fourth down and ten yards to go. After the punt, the Indians will start with the first down and 10 from their own 30-yard line. Jackson Kathy, the ball here for the Indians. Brought down by Landon Bickerstaff. No gain on the play. Brings up second down, 10 yards to go for the Indians. Jackson Parker is brought down in the backfield by Mason Bear. Last on the play, he picks up third down and 20 yards to go for the Indians. Yeah. <laughs> 
Lead it to Jackson County. Brought down by Hayden Smith. Indians have fourth down and 14 yards to go. That's the end of our first half with the score Indians 34 or 0. Ladies and gentlemen, for your halftime presentation, the entertainment for Groveton ISD proudly presents the Groveton Tribe of Pride Marching Band. The band is under the field direction of head drum major Adriana Vasquez. Our assistant drum major is Jaden Hart. Our drum line captain is Charlie Jackson. 
For your halftime entertainment, the tribe will perform their 70s rock show, China Grove and 25 or 6 to 4. Yeah! <laughs> Grofton fans, let's show some Indian pride while the band plays the Grofton fight song. This concludes our halftime presentation. This week's outstanding marcher is Iris Velasquez. The Indian band is under the direction of Jason Turrentine.
Kickoff is down by the Oilers, number 17, Landon Fredrickson. Oilers will start out with a first down and 10 from their own 35-yard line. Marcus on the quarterback keeper for the Oilers, brought down by Wyatt Sneed. Loss of one on the play, brings up second down and 11 yards to go for the Oilers. Ray Frije carrying the ball for the Oilers. Tackle made by Tristan Ard. Loss on play brings up third down and 13 yards to go for the Oilers. White Snead taking the punt for the Indians. Tackle made by Landon Bickerstaff. The Indians will start out with the first down and 10 from the older 47 yard line. is completed to Billy Thomas, brought down by Landon Fredrickson and Colt White. Gain of seven yards on the play, brings up second down, three yards to go for the Indians. Darius McQueen, the ball carrier for the Indians. Brought down by Landon Fredrickson. 
Comes in up for a first down. The Indians have a first down and 10 at the order of 28 Norman. Last attempt by the Indians is broken up by Logan Houghton. And just took it down and 10 yards to go. Darius McQueen, the ball carrier for the Indians, brought down by Jocelyn Bickerstaff. Indians have third down and seven yards to go. Pass was completed to Jacob Alexander. Players enough for a first down. The Indians will have a first down and 10 at the order of 16 yard line. Number 17 of the Indians goes in for a touchdown. The extra point kick by Jackson Cathy is good. Aiden Smith taking the kickoff for the orders. Brought down by Jacob Alexander. Orders will start out with a first down and 10 from their own 37 yard line.
Great retake turned the ball for the Oilers, tripped up by Gunnar Wilson. Gain of eight yards on the play, brings up second down, two yards to go for the Oilers. Pass attempt by the Oilers is incomplete. Brings up third down and two yards to go. Retake here in the ball for the Oilers. Stopped by Tristan Ard. That was enough for a first down. Oilers will have a first down and 10 at the Indian 49 yard line. Send the ball clear for it. The Oilers brought down by Logan Townsend. We have a penalty flag on the field. Setting penalties on sportsmanlike conduct against both teams. Oilers have second down and ten yards to go. PJ carrying the ball for the Oilers, brought down by Gunnar Wilson. Gain of four yards on the play, brings up third down and six yards to go. Again, carrying the ball for the Oilers. Brought down by Tristan Hard. Oilers have fourth down and four yards to go. Aiden Smith carrying the ball for the Oilers. Go down by Carter Cox. That was enough for a first down. The Oilers have a first down ten at the Indian 40 yard line.
So he did take care of the ball for New Orleans. Brought down by Brody Thornton. And four yards on the play brings up second down and six yards to go for the Oilers. Field on the play is false start against the Oilers. Or we'll have second down and 11 yards to go. Ray Free Jay carrying the ball for the Oilers. Throw down by Dayton Chandler. Oilers have third down and seven yards to go. Three James Bond here for the Oilers. Start down by Dayton Chandler. That's the end of our third quarter with the score. Indians 41, Oilers 0.
Logan Houghton, the ball carrier for the Oilers. Tackle made by Logan Townsend. Also on the play, brings up second down, 12 yards to go. the ball carrier for the Oilers, brought down by Brody Thornton. Oilers have third down and one yard to go. Carrying the ball for the orders. Brought down by Gunnar Wilson. We have filthy flags on the field. against the Oilers and a personal foul face mask against the Indians. Penalties will offset. We play third down. The Oilers have third down and one yard to go. Satchel, the quarterback keeper for the Oilers. Tackle made by Carter Cox. by the owners is no good.
We just had a red iPhone cell phone turned into the press box. If you're missing your cell phone, come up here and claim it. Rosa taking a kickoff for the Indians. <laughs> Indians are strong over the first down and 10 from their own 45 yard line. is false start against the Indians. on the play is first foul against the Oilers. After the penalty, the Indians will have a first down and 10 at the Oilers 42 yard line. Keeper for the Indians, knocked out of bounds by Jocelyn Bickerstaff. <laughs> Indians have second down and 11 yards to go. For the Indians, brought down by Jocelyn Bickerstaff. Indians have third down and seven yards to go. Here for the Indians, brought down by Jocelyn Bickerstaff. 
That was enough for a first down. The Indians have a first down 10 if you're a 30 yard man. Sent by the Indians goes incomplete. Brings up second down and ten yards to go. Here from the Indians, brought down by Logan Wells. Indians have third down and six yards to go. Indian 34 yard line. Come 
And he's going to get the ball carried for the corner. And that's the end of our ball game with the final score. Indians 41 order 6.